News live from the office of me. Hello. Uh, so firstly, CK3 Series A coming soon. TM. Uh, it's a, it's going to be a pretty ridiculous series. I'm going to build a massive mod pack for it, or have built a massive mod pack for it. It's going to be in the part of the world we've never played before, as a religion we've never played before. Um, with a very strange mechanic that I'm not going to go into details of, but it's a, it's a silly challenge run, kind of. Uh, Part B, uh, on the second channel, Vampire of the Masquerade Bloodlines. I'm, I'm doing a playthrough of the first game, so if you haven't seen that before, go watch it. Because uh, I plan on doing Vampire of the Masquerade Bloodlines 2 when it comes out. Probably on the main channel. We'll see. Um, part 3, Part B, what am I up to? Uh, number point four. Uh, I know that the achievement doesn't work in this. I, I don't know if I made that clear last episode. Um, I did leave a comment both episodes in response to that. Um, but the, the achievement currently for this character is bugged. I'm just doing it to say that we've done it. Um, you bet you... Okay, it's not bugged, but you have to do it all in one session. So you have to start playing as the first character, and you have to never close the game up until you've completed it. So it is technically... Uh, uh, more or less impossible. Um, you could be a big nerd and leave your PC on and cost yourself thousands of pounds on electricity, but who's going to do that? Um, so here we are, playing as Killer Karen of Gobia. 56, mighty and powerful, feeling fine. Let me just check the achievements still working, because we're going to be able to get some achievements, even if we don't get the big one, right? There we are, we're all good. Um... So yesterday, swallowed up the entirety of House of Land. House of Land still our liege. No, he's not. We got independence of the final thing we did. Um, so the final thing to do then is take House of Land for our own. We've got to kill him on the title. I believe all we're waiting for is the... Yeah, we're quite literally just waiting for the truce to expire. Then we take that. We're good. I am king now. Uh, that's fantastic. And then we'll just start swallowing up things over to probably the the east. Because we've got a holy site over there that we can't do anything with right now. But is... It relatively within striking distance, specifically right there. Um, so we'll head over. We'll have to go to war with Nubia. By the time we get over there, we'll probably be strong enough. I want to try and tidy up this as much as possible before Ghana or Song Hei gets over to it. To be honest, taking out Song Hei as the first thing we do would be the most sensible thing just to break them up. You know, if we can break these guys up, start taking some of their some of their titles, like their vassals rebel, you know, just kind of orchestrate their downfall a little bit. That would be ideal. Don't want to break it up so much that Ghana sweeps in because Ghana is Ghana clap us if we're not careful here. So... First things first, let's give away some domain tiles. What have we got? Um, so we've got Daura, which I think we should probably hold on to. Katsina, which is our current capital. Sokoto. Um, let's give away Sokoto, because that's the worst one. My son and ward. So, somebody said that uh, I married off my brother matrilineally and my son matrilineally. Uh, doesn't really matter too much, seeing as we're female only. Um, but I feel like we should probably only land women, as is the point of the campaign. Um... But it's either, like, right now we don't have any, but in the future I probably will. Uh, we'll land our son. Why not? For the time being. We could end up with some faction problems further down the line. But I'm going to land him to keep it in the family. Um, and we can call him in always. Oh, we're stressed now. For reasons. God, shy sucks. What caused us to become stressed that time? Oh, because we're greedy. <laughs> Greedy and Shy are such low tier. Like, Greedy in CK2. Phenomenal. Uh, shy in CK2. A bit crap. Uh, but not so bad. And I looked at this and I thought, oh, that's pretty good because it gives you 15% scheme resistance. If it gave you 15% defensive plot power in CK2, it would be incredible. Um, in this, though, anybody coming to court is shite. Um, fought for a character that's shy, so we're going to try and never get that again. Uh, let's, firstly, let's work off some stress. Another lap. And then let's also eat a tasty cake because you've done some run. Now you can have a tasty cake. Um, and then after all that, no, obviously we won't. Um... Right, okay, we're good then. So the family holds most of the land, which is fantastic. We're relatively stable right now. I believe our domain is under control too. Um, yeah, we're fine. I haven't got the really nice outliner this time around, but that's all right. Oh, you can't see control at all on the outliner without it. Bloody hell. Wow, that's terrible. Um, I mean, <laughs> thanks, Paradox. Um, it's not... The outline is pretty crap in CK3 compared to CK2, but hey, that's all right. So, let's kick around. And let's decide our next target. What have we got? 1,593. We need to kick around and reinforce for quite a while. I should have specified. Um, 2,471 at maximum. So we could go south and take out Nupe. Uh, we could go north and take out air. We could take out air and try and control the central Sahara. I don't want to make borders with the big powerful boys. We don't want borders with him. No, he's actually not too strong. The Abbasids we definitely don't want borders with. Or do we actually? What? They're kind of piss weak in this, aren't they? Okay, you know what? Let's just see how it goes then. I'm not going to sweat it too much. Song Hei, I think, is our biggest threat then. Right there, very powerful. We could swear fealty and do exactly what we did again. Oh, that would be so funny. Um, We really, really could, couldn't we? We could swear fealty and just swallow him up from the inside. We've got the safety. Song Hei's got safety. Then they're not going to go anywhere. I think I'll do it. I think I'm going to do that. Fuck it. 
All right, my liege. Hello. You might think this is a weird play, but if we don't do that, we're, we're, we're liable to get hit by um, Song Hei attacking us. These guys could attack us when they reinforce one dollar. 3,200 dudes there. This is safe because with our combined forces, Song Hei is untouchable now. Um, <laughs> and more to the point, we can just do the same thing again. So firstly, we'll go for Dende. Work the shaft. Uh, let's get you fabricating climbs. Actually, do we even need to fabricate climbs? Let me just double check before I fall into the... One of the traps. We've already got claims on DMR. So we'll take Zama and Dendi. And then we'll take out her just straight away. No question. Ella Karen keeps her trait for giving. You bring shame to the name Karen. She must never let others walk over her. Uh, yeah, that's a that's a Karen thing right there. Wrathful. To my friendly... To my friend... Oh, friendless vassal, you son of a bitch. I've come to the inexorable conclusion that you are probably the best candidate I have for an open counter position. Um, Spymaster of Song Hey, Brother, you have just opened yourself up for a world of pain. Uh, the sacking of Gawari. Oh. Pay work L for the loss, because we're greedy. Give him 30 gold, because his place got sacked. Or we just take the 35 pre- I think I prefer the 35 prestige. Actually, we've got a lot of gold. Let's work on upgrading our capital, then. So, can't see any trouble holding. Oh, God. Uh, we were drunkard. 30, hang on. You get, you, 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 you do a, you do a drink. Hang on, we're not a drunkard, though. Oh, too many cakes. Sorry. Um... Hang on, so you, you, so you do the hashish cake so that you lose the stress, but then you have to... <laughs> the only easy way out of it is gaining more stress. What? Um, if anybody obvious... So, oh, fucking hell. <laughs> what, so it's either we gain stress and lose opinion. Who, who is she? Fellow vassal, neighboring vassal, one we're about to war with, I assume. Yeah, I don't care what she thinks of us. Let's go for this one, try and lose. Hey, there we go. That was a good roll. Demand five payments because we're landing our family members. Oh, that accidentally had a nice side effect, didn't it? Wow. <laughs> oh, holy shit. Um, thank you. Much appreciated. A good deal. And I ransomed some dudes out to there. Right, so what do we want to focus on as our capital? We can make Daora, D Daora? Daora as our capital. Um, there are special buildings available for that one. Or we go for this one, which obviously has ducal buildings available. Um, the duchy buildings or special buildings. I wonder what special buildings you get for that. And that's all part of the same duchy, is it not? Oh, it's not. Fuck. That sucks. Um, so really, we want to keep... This is our capital in Kano. I guess it doesn't really matter too much. But I, I want to keep that because we've got the opportunity for a special building. So we take Kano. We keep Kano as our capital. Give away Katsina and use this one. Like the actual province of Kano as a capital. But keep Daura in our realm. I think that would make the most sense. Um, so why don't we just focus on upgrading this thing as we're always going to keep it. Let's go markets then. Why not? We need to upgrade the tribal hold. Um, just the gold, which we've got plenty of. I guess we could upgrade our current capital. There's no reason not to. We're just kind of nerfing ourselves if we don't. There it is. 78 gold for our first claim. So that was Zama. Let's go down to Dende. Okay, this is going to be quite fast. And then we're taking all the power away from Songhei. And they can do nothing to stop us. Then we just go for independence. Um, and in all that time, hopefully our truce with House Alam will disappear. What's our truce again? Sorry, brother. Uh, truce with us. 931. Okay, we've got a couple of years still. What alliance power have we got? So non-matrilineal, we've got Chieftain of Grebo. But matrilineal... We've got an Emirate of Wadai. Let's go Alliance Power, actually. Oh, hi, Chiefdom. Hey, all those people left comments saying you married off X and Y matrilineally. It was the right move, turns out. Uh, okay, so we go for you. You've got a decent amount of land. How many troops you got? 2,500. Wow. Um, granted, it's potentially stunting our dynasty a lot, but if I'm marrying off all daughters, it makes no difference mechanically. You got 50-50 chance of having a son and a daughter. We're just flipping the game on its head entirely. Everything should remain the same. Um, yeah, done. No problem with that. Plus, he's a stinky son. Get out of here. And now we can demand a payment as well. Excellent. Right. Short Sibida. Um, What do you like? Rowdy, arrogant, callous. My type of person. Right. Okay. Let's educate you then. Um, what's our air looking like right now? Killer Karen uh, is wrathful and bossy. Again, my type of person. Stewardship or Marshall? I guess we'll go... I guess we'll go Marshall. Yeah, I'm all right with that. And we are her guardian too. Just wanted to double check. Fine. Killer Karen the second coming in to take control. I actually quite like inheriting as a grandchild instead. Because it means we're going to be able to play as her for the longest period of time. Um, consults are a bit irrelevant at this stage of the game, to be honest. Right, go on a pilgrimage. I suppose we could. We might as well spend this money on something. Seeing as we're already upgrading the, the stuff we want to keep. Um, Igbo. Let's go on a long one. We can usurp a title there. So I'll be taking that one from you. Thank you, friend. Um, few champions. Right. Let's be careful not usurping too many duchy level titles. In fact, I probably shouldn't have done that in hindsight. Um, let's bring some more champions to court then. Why not? 
Uh, just because we hold too many, there's only so far we can grow to do. Oh, to be fair, we've already got four. <laughs> yeah, uh, we've already got four, huh? Although they don't really care, do they? Mother, plus 50. That's helpful when you land only your family members. I quite like this idea. It's working really well, because then we can also demand, because we're house head, we already have hooks. This is nice. Um, 28 stress. Yeah, everything this woman does stresses her out, so I'm more than happy to get rid of that. Keeps the trait stubborn. Is this short scimitar? Um, stubborn? Small boost to health. That's quite, that's quite good. Um, stewardship plus three. Legion vassal opinion lower. Uh, vengeful. Oh, I like that. Diplomacy minus two, but that's a sh short price to pay for all of that excellent stuff you get there. Or chased. Rubbish. Gain, yeah, vengeful. All in. So we gain 375. We potentially become a wise woman. We did become a wise woman. Fantastic. So people were saying, apparently, if we offer ourselves to the spirits, um, on activity already, hang on, come home. If we offer ourselves to the spirits, there's a chance of us becoming possessed via that method. That'd be fantastic. It's good to be home. Welcome. And then we should also go on pilgrimages just straight as soon as possible, basically. Um, now let's go ahead and... What do we need for this one? I've sought the aid of the spirits in the past five years. Okay, I wish you would tell me a cooldown instead. That's quite annoying. Um, sought the aid of the spirits. She's stupor. Wind spirits blessing. There it is. So we've got two years on that one as well. No reason to not become celibate. Besides, I assume the just the free piety, clergy opinion. Revelous and seducers are annoyed, but to be honest, that's not really a big concern. Um, search for a physician. Let's not do that. Let's host another feast then. Why not? Because we get the we have the lavish feasts. We we have the kind of uh, piety feast, don't we? I can't remember the name of the doctrine, but that's all right. Had an interesting conversation with our son. Um, okay, yeah. Form a foreign friendship with him. That's all right. I know he's married matrilineal. Eventually, that title will pass outside of our, outside of our family. But we can get rid of that. Why is this tiny child stood in front of the gallows? Uh, compassionate or callous? Compassionate or arrogant? Arrogant is really terrible, isn't it? Um, callous, callous, callous. Callous is quite nice. Quite like that one. Okay. Uh, keeps compassionate. Compassionate for a warfare character doesn't seem right. Yeah, do it. Beat him. The callous, wrathful, bossy. That seems incredible. Um, every champion gains 20 opinion. Oh, yeah. I'm all, all definitely going for that. Actually, we should see what champions turned up. Let's take a look here. Nine out of nine. Oh, welcome. Holy shit. Oh, yeah. You're better. I mean, I'm going to recruit anybody who is not at the bottom of the list, basically. And we can just get rid of the ones at the bottom of the list. Um, so this is our brother-in-law marrying our courtier. Born into House of Jawa. Now, she's a lowborn. Am I getting any sort of alliance with that? Um, because she's just a courtier. I'm not going to do that one. My brother-in-law marrying off to my courtier. Oh, that doesn't really matter then. Because he's not related to us anyway. Yeah, I don't give a shit about that. Go on. I just wanted to double-check all the marriages, but I don't know why why they even asked us about that one, to be frank. We've been caught into a war. What is that? Bagurimian conquest of the Emirate of Salamat. We're on the attacking side. I don't think we need to worry about that one too much, do we? How long until that claim's in? We're about 60% of the way there. Uh, you can park for the stewardship lifestyle. That's good to know. Golden Aplomb. Monthly income per stress level plus 10%. Might not be too bad with this character, given that she's constantly on on edge. Um, tax woman. Oh, God. Cutting cornerstones. To be fair, we are going to build a lot of stuff, hopefully, with her. And try and upgrade things, basically, whenever we can. Shame we haven't got the outliner, so we can't really keep an eye on it. But that's all right. Yeah, see, we're almost done here. Even if it saves 10 gold, that's going to be better than tax woman, realistically. Bearing in mind her lifespan. Oh. Please accept this gift. <laughs> what? Okay, thank you, Liege. Much appreciated. I do need a lot of gold, so I appreciate that a lot. Um, right, there we are. So, building's complete. We can only build palisades now. I guess there's no reason not to in that case. Bloody counselors dying. Selfish friggin' stewards. You know how difficult it is to get bloody good counselors these days. And the claim. Right, here we go. Hello. Remember me? Um, please don't round piece me. Uh, is there even round piece in CK3? I don't think I've seen it. There's just crown authority, isn't it, that can restrict or open that up? Um, anyway, let's set our rally point just here. Thank you. And then, time to clap. How many troops you got? 700. Not for long, you won't. My claims? We can only press them one at a time, obviously, but it doesn't really matter too much. Um, should we start there? Cut them in half, and then we can just raise troops there in the future. I like that idea. All right, go on then. Hello. They do have some allies coming in, so just bear that in mind. We should probably go and kill their troops off before we do anything else. Right, heading over in that direction. We won the war. Thank you for letting me know. Wrong war, but that's okay. We'll take the cattle first and seeing as they're sodding off. Just kind of wandering around. Okay. Well, at this rate, we'll just be able to siege everything before they even settle. What are they doing? Going for the capital? They are now. Okay, we'll finish their capital and then we'll swing over. Or the, the war goal and then we'll swing over. 
Son of a weak soul, non-believer. Wow. Right, get over there, kill him dead. This wall's done. Oh! You son of a bitch. Uh, <laughs> should have probably predicted that one. Well, you motherfucker, every time. Oh, God. Okay. I feel like that's way more common in CK3 than it is in CK2. Way more common. Fucking hell. Well, never mind. Very annoyed by that. Um, yeah. Right, there we go. Okay, you're on my fucking kill list then, you shit. 6%. Oh, no bloody surprise. Killer Karen gains skill tactician and logician. That's not bad. 13. I, again, not terrible, but not great either. Um, we've got Wrathful that gives natural dread. We've got Callus that gives dread decay negatives. For someone who should be put in control of everything, maybe not as a martial leader, not, not actually personally commanding the armies, she's not bad at all. I'm all right with that. Um, just going around sieging, to be honest with you. What's this one? Some hand wolf for the chieftain of Kano. Uh, did I do that? He's taking Kano, you son of a bitch. Oh, I wanted to do that one, never mind. I accidentally just helped him there. I was just going raiding. Oh, he gave it to me anyway. Hey! <laughs> oh, well, that's nice of you. Um, I wanted to make the capital at some point, but I've just gone ahead and upgraded these ones, so never bloody mind, I guess. Oh, he accidentally did what I was going to do anyway. Okay, fine. Um, right, so. Let's take a look. House of Warriors. Prowess plus two, night effectiveness 15%. Mostly fair. Popular opinion plus five. I, th I think that's pointless. Uh, dread gain 20%. Uh, ruling through dread is okay. Noble veins is so good that a lot of these don't even hold a bloody candle to it. 30% congenital traits and 30% new inheritable. Oh, it's just so good. Takes genius from a 5% to a 35%. That's assuming one parent, obviously. Um, it's just so powerful. Shit. I mean, Vibrant Court is also pretty good. Uh, desirable match, also very good. I mean, that one actually, I think, won us the last campaign single-handedly. Fertility 10% is okay. I, I can't not take it. I can't not take it. It's so powerful. But I remember we're also going to have less children if we're playing only women, because we've got a nine-month limit. When you're playing the male character, obviously, you... limit is, uh, well, depends on the person, really. Um, right. Oh, hello. No. <laughs> huh. No, I won't be doing that. Uh, Aaron married. Right, right, okay, so we've got Killer Karen then, our granddaughter. So I want to marry you off to, I mean, Nuh has Herculean. So if we can get that with the new Inherit Chance too, let's let's go for it. I think that's a great idea. I'm going to give Gobir away to my daughter. Uh, like I said, keep landing family members. We can demand payments from them, etc. Um, seek the aid of a spirit. Ah, here we go. Right. Um, so we have to say this one. Offering bad is, isn't my presence here enough. Um, see, I thought that would just give bad responses, but I assume that might actually result in us being possessed. Um, do it. Go on, then. Nothing. We got absolutely nothing at all. You offer yourself? I guess that works. Uh, nothing. Okay, yeah, that's that's the reason why I thought I wouldn't take that one. I assume there's a low chance of getting a possession from that. We might as well hold a Mystic Communion whenever the hell we can, because that's always quite nice. Uh, is there anything else I want to mark as interest? Maybe work off stress, because that one's quite good. We could attack south. We've got 1,500 troops. Uh, these guys have... Oh, sorry. They've got 1,500. We've got 2,200. Um, or 2,500, actually. Wow. Let's just double check our knights, make sure we're on top of that. Yep, we're good. Let's go and force you. I mean, he is, again, Herculean, married to our heir, so I'd rather not get him killed, but... I also want to win in combat, so... You know what? Let's do it. Okay, well, we'll focus on their troops first, then. Lesson learned? Fine. I'll accept that. Uh, change of next We go for, like... Oh, look at that. 250 prestige for all of that. Or piety, sorry, for all of that. Boom. No question about it. That is a, that is a safe bet right there. Right, catch the troops first. Kill them dead. Potential battle. We are likely to win that one very easily. Go. That's what we like to see. Boom. Kill them dead. Okay, go for the capital next. We got 15%. I don't think they're going to do much with those troops, but I will keep an eye on and make sure they don't go for our bloody capital again. We are ill. Fuck. Somebody shouted at me yesterday in the comment section because I didn't check them. Strangely enough, uh, the more expensive one is the better one. And that's like 90... Well, every single time I've seen the more expensive one being the better one. You kind of assume so. I guess there's a, a very small percent chance that you could end up with a shit position. Um, randomly. Anyway, do no more than what is necessary. Excellent work. We'll be fine. We've got that healthy trait. We've got the... You know, we finished that learning troop. That's, we're not going to die here. Oh, that's that's nice. Okay, go over here. Kill them dead. Get out of my lands, please. No more of this shit. Right, be gone. Good work. Uh, council position. Chancellor died. Probably died in battle then. Um, my vassal. 
Vassal and skilled. Wow, that's a nice change of pace. Um, let's go for a ponder. For uh, 81%. Oh, wow. Okay, well, this is this is done. This is an easy war. Very nice. Okay, that's going to give us a shitload more land. I'll dish it out to family members if we can. Glad to be well again. Told you she'd be fine. Right, let's kill off some troops rather than start another siege. Okay, done. And done. Easy. Right, good shit. That makes up for it. Very nice. Okay, who wants all this stuff then? Let's see if we've got a family member who would like... Basically, bear in mind we can't give out a duchy, but we can... Okay, so our, our grandson. Fine. Um, I would give him a title. Gotta make sure we don't give out duchies here. We're not a high enough rank quite yet. Um, I'm happy to give it to... To N, your champion. That wouldn't be terrible. He's already landed anyway. Oh, sorry. He's, he's gonna stick around either way. Um, your granddaughter, heir, and friend. If I give it to you, we're just gonna inherit it back. But I guess that's not necessarily a bad thing. Uh, just finished her education and all that, so we're fine. Let's get rid of these boys. Uh, powerful must expect position. So 19 learning. Yep, yeah, no question about that. Swap you boys out. We can't. I'm sorry. I can't give my son... Oh, because it's only women, of course. Um, and we've got Kaduna. It's 11 stewardship. Oh, I suppose that's okay. Go on, then. Fine. There you are. Um, and then we've got Rano. 18. Damn, these guys are like really good learning stats. Unfortunately, there's nothing we can do about that. But let's invest in what will eventually be our capital. I think we'll just go for the gold buildings. And just only the gold buildings. Um, my man. My man died. Tragic. Uh, let's get... Sorry, let's go to Council Tab a second. Not ransom you guys out. How much are worth? Uh, two. <laughs> uh, and who are you for? Neighboring ruler. Do we really want a favor? Into weak hook. We could always blackmail him, I guess. Go on, then. Kick him out. Sod it. We could have demanded conversion. But it really makes no bloody difference at this point, does it? That should give us some payments. There we are. There we are. There we are. Very nice. Excellent. And we got a stewardship perk, too. I've basically just been going down this one, to be honest. Um, so that we can build up our building slightly faster. Try and make ourselves a bit more of a powerhouse. Because everybody starts quite low level. So if we focus on it, we can very quickly gain advantage just through kind of development buildings. That type of thing. It takes 25%. I really don't want that. Claim thrown against your liege pointless. We can do that anyway. Well, effectively. Um, I think her stress level is irrelevant. Man at arms dread. Go on. We'll go for that one. Could just cut a swath south straight down. Um, kind of reconnect all of this. God, we are quite the power, aren't we? Wow. I think Marley split out of Ghana too there. Oh, we are quite powerful. Um, Canem's a little bit concerning. 4,100. So I'm thinking we head south, take this before they do, and then turn on them when we get the kingdom level title. Um, so let's take Oyo. Can we move our troops down here? There we are. Right. Get roasted. Uh, conquer the duchy again. I'll conquer duchies. Uh, I haven't got the prestige for it. Uh, press claims for you, who's our vassal. Makes him quite powerful, though. Um, we also don't have the prestige for it. In fact, we don't have the bloody prestige for anything, do we? 75. Yeah, okay. That's just one. What, what are we taking from you there? Sorry, am I? Oh. <laughs> Oh, okay. I don't really want that. Thank you. But we'll just take what we can down here again. Specifically just to stop these guys. But if we take that one, that puts a border with Igbo land. And if they want to expand down here, they have to attack either Igbo land or us. Gives a nice buffer. All right, let's go for that one then. Nice. This shouldn't take too long either. This should be a really easy one, actually. Um, troops are kind of kicking around there. Don't worry about it too much. Again, we should definitely be able to siege. Those those ones are probably safe to ignore. I have to run all the way over to their bloody capital. And I hope we don't lose control over there. That's all right. Um, do troops careful. Those ones might get us. Right. Scheme at court. Ooh, exposed. That's quite good. Blackmail for that for a hook in a second. Might as well expand while we've got these traits. Truce ends. Oh, thank you. That's good. Okay. I think that was the guy we just went to war for, uh, Igbo land. Okay, done. Easy, easy, easy. Thank you very much. Another title for me. All right, we're going to give this to... I didn't really care, to be honest. Uh, let's give it to someone with high marshal. Yeah, you can have it. You seem trustworthy. Sorry, new pay. New pay is what I meant. Um, so we can go as well with him again if we feel like it. Conquer another duchy. Uh, which we've got to be careful doing because we have picked up a lot of freaking duchies. Um, invade kingdom for 2,000. I think we need to focus internally. What, what's our truce with you? Ended. Okay. Um, sure. Let's try this again. This time, let's not screw it up. Um, let's go for Zama. Oh, let's bring you guys up here. Focus on the troops this time. Apparently, they can, apparently, we just stand out waiting for them to turn up. We stand there in handcuffs, kneeled. You know, ready, ready for them to take us away. Right, go on. Okay. Kill. Oh, they're in the middle of a war right now. Well, this is 
Opportune timing, isn't it? Hey, you better run. That's what I thought, trying to siege my promises. They didn't even bother going for the capital this time. Right, nice. Go for their capital next. Someone else is already sieging it, but we might be able to take control from them. There we go. Okay. Easy peasy this time. Not a problem at all. And done. Thank you very much. And our liege is winning wars too. That is a good thing. Um, that's going to provide... Oh, and now we can start fabricating Clemson period too. That's just providing a bit more stability for the realm at this point. Stability that we're kind of pulling apart, but that's okay. Right, get out of here. And then you go to, again, I'm going to go for high marshals. Um, so that when eventually they, they almost certainly declare war on us, um, I'm screwed because they've all got massive levy sizes, but that's fine. Um, let's go for gold and a plum. We might be able to get down to avaricious. It's not really that good, but it's okay. Right, 366 gold. Let's go back to Kano then. We need to get control over here, actually. Um, night effectiveness. Quite like night effectiveness. And then you, oh, that good counselor died. Or is that a leader's council? I thought so. Um, right, let's get you there. Let's get you there as well. Um, stop probably getting climbs up here. This is all just another... This is a count. It was all just a count. Wow. Okay. Well, we'll grab what we can. Bloody hell. <laughs> yeah, you know, I've decided I do like gold. Gold! Look at it all. Good God. 133 again. I'm, I'm telling you, that's getting nerfed. Get your, get your hooks while you can, because that is disappearing in no time, my friends. So that one's upgraded. That's the only one we're actually going to keep in the long term. Um, what's the other one in our Dutch? Is it Rano? It is Rano, so I'd like to take that one back eventually. Um, we can upgrade the tribal hold. I'm just going to hold on to the cash. Sod it. We might as well. Again, five opinions. She pays zero to me. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I just get the automatic ransom. I didn't realize it would give me nothing. That doesn't matter. Can't spend this, uh, the, the gold anyway right now, so it really makes absolutely no difference. Oh, we're ill, but we got divine guidance. I'm actually kind of hoping she dies soon so we can play as killer Karen before she gets too old. Um, uh, leave me be. Go on. She's had her day. She's 69. The perfect age to die. Come on. One year and I'll press your claim. No, I won't. I won't be alive then. Bollocks. She will. She's too powerful. You're feeling fine. This is my own fault for putting too many points in the scholarship tree. The one opportunity we actually get to skip to a child who's like of the perfect age would have been 18. Oh, God. Okay, we create another duchy. I'll put that with my collection of duchies. If we die, we're gonna look, everything's going to fall apart, actually, because of partition, right? I assume we're on partition. Um... Oh, female preference, confederate partition. That's just code for fucking terrible. Um, we might have to break free. We might have to break free temporarily. Oh, God, we can't afford the prestige. That's all right. Have a feast. Um, we'll break free and then not lose everything. That seems like a sensible idea right now. Um, I lay with 25-year-old boy. Done. Or was that a lady? I think it said there was a chance of pregnancy. Whatever. What am I, doctor? I don't know how these things work. Uh, <laughs> we can still take a consult, which is fucking phenomenal. Uh, except the invitation. Yeah, okay, anything for a bit of prestige. Actually, we've got enough already. Damn. Right. Hello. Uh, I'm, I'm leaving now. Thank you for taking care of me. I've decided I'm, uh, sick of your shit. Right, where's my, my rally? Bring him there. Well, this should be a relatively easy war. We'll just charge straight up the middle and hit his capital straight away. Um, what a show you put on. Gained four stress. <laughs> Thanks. God damn, get out of here. Right. Okay, oh, they're actually reinforcing. Man, I was going to chase them down. No, we don't have to worry about it if we're getting independence because we can just conquest. There we go. Right. Um, Go for the capital then. Sod it. War soundtrack has a real Stellaris vibe to it, doesn't it? With the with the kind of chorus in the background there. Are we done? Oh, unpause. That will help. 73%. That'll do. Um, and then I'll just destroy everything. And we'll just start from here and work backwards, I guess. Got to be keeping an eye on our capital again. Ooh, that's a lot of boys. Well, that'll do. There we go. 100%. Thank you very much. Now, fascinated by Banus. That's pretty good. Right. There we are. Back to Gobi. And we should be able to make a kingdom level title, correct? House of Land. Are we allowed to make that again? Uh, Usurp. That's better. Right. So now we're not going to lose anything, which is fantastic. The problem is now we can't use our tactic before of getting inside and then swallowing up from within. Boring kingdoms is not going to go down. Right. New bloody... Yes, yes, yes. God damn these notifications. Okay. Um, can use the sell turtles decision. So people have told me before that that isn't the. You're not you're not selling titles. You're you're selling minor titles. So it's 150 prestige for 120 gold. Done. There we are. Um, greeting. It's not on as I see, but if you need God, I believe we've come sort of some arrangement. Um, yeah, that's no problem. Getting some weak hook on us. We're gonna die soon anyway. You fool. That's a bad investment. It'd be a war. It'd be a war with. 
Uh, I thought it said Samoan then for a second. I was going to say, like, hell we are. Um, Sa Saoan de Jour War for the treatment of Kotoka. Okay, we're an ally in that one. And we're a defender in this one. Oh, for Rano. You didn't tell me about this. Okay. Uh, I suppose we should probably do something about that then, huh? <laughs> well, that sucks. Okay. Let's get to war. A good deal. Thank you, my friend. A little bit of gold there. Please get out of my realm. This is my realm now. I am king. Please leave. We need to give away some dodgy level cards. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay. Um, vassals, vassals, vassals. What's wrong with you? What do you want? Uh, of... Oh, of here? Sarkin? What are you, like, uh... Oh, no, that's just where he is right now. Ooh. Right, hang on. Go back. Go back. Right, where are you actually landed, then? I was gonna give you the... Do you know, Yowri. He's got a claim on Kebby. Where's Kebby? I'll give you that. Yeah, no problem. That's all yours, brother. I don't, I don't care about that. Right, grant, grant title. Grand title. Cabby, all yours. Say no more. Boom. Okay. Uh, let's go through next vassal. Uh, they're all related to us, and I've been extorting them the entire game, but the probably they just don't care still. Uh, right, so Chitman of Kano is ours. Um, I'd rather keep Katsina for the time being. Go Bear. Where's Go Bear? This one up the north. Okay. Give it to you or give it to you? I'm going to give it to you because you have a lower opinion of me, which seems like it doesn't make sense, but it definitely does in CK2 terms. There we are. CK3 terms. You know what I meant. Right. Excellent. Uh, how many Dutch Darts have we got now? Two. Are they all right with that? Are they bothered? Um, you can create another Dutchie. Do I want to do that? Fine. Go on. Why not? Give some, give some claims after all. Right. I'm going to give that to... Give it to you, I guess. Here you are. One title. Oh, he's my family too. That's fantastic. Uh... Kanupe, there we are. Boom. Let's also get him a marriage too. Am I allowed to marry him off? Uh, please marry. Allow marriage. Let's disallow marriage. No, just just marry. Arrange marriage. That's the button. Uh, I want to marry. No, I want to marry you. Oh, <laughs> uh, you to him. I have a feeling that won't work. Please, could you kindly leave and never? Oh my God. Hello. Two years ago, you promised to aid me. Uh, just a gold. Fine, I'll help you out. Good God. Right, there we go. Oh, they see something else. You shit. Is our allies happy? Now we just got to take out this one. Oh, there we go. I don't think I've ever had Avaricious before. Holding tax is 15%. That's going to be all about two gold here. 6.4 per month. Yeah, that was not really worth it. Right. Uh, Time rediscovered. Thank you, old ledger. And you're done. I'll take another 48 gold. Thank you. A lot of money. We got like an absurd amount of money right now. Oh, speaking of which, there we go. Uh, and I guess I can demand some more payments too. We're going to break a thousand gold here. It seems a bit weird. We've got three tribal holdings and we're this rich. This is heresy. Look at this. It's insane. Thank you. Wow. I get the strange feeling that... Oh, no, it does work. Okay. I was going to say I get the strange feeling that that, uh, that event has actually given us stewardship experience, but we did gain some. Um, different culture opinion, plus 15. What, our opinion of them or their opinion of us? Uh, faithful, clergy opinion, scientific, cultural fascination, progress. Actually, that's pretty good. Yeah, I'll take that one. Mainly right now, because uh, we're the head of house uh, um, culture, I've switched this over to city planning because we're very close to being there and we got all this gold. If we could discover this before she dies, we're going to save a fortune and we can potentially get a load more stuff. Mystic? Hey, there we go. Wow, I bet she's actually quite beloved, isn't she? So level two Mystic gives plus 10 opinion to Boris. Bet you love that, Boris, you freak. What have we got? Um, I mean, our vassals love us with the exception of this guy. Why? What's wrong with you? Um, what's a seat on the council? Uh, you're a pretty good steward, actually. Um, not right for liege. Foreign culture. Foreign culture? Who the, who the hell are you? Berber? You're a long way from home. Okay. Well, he's not really that far. Right, let's give him, uh, let's give him a taste of our medicine. Oh, I was going to promote culture, but we're already there. I think, so. you'll find you're the foreign culture. Right, okay. Um... What was I doing? Can't remember. I was going to sack the steward and replace it with that guy. There you are. Shut up. Right. And then you can convert culture in your own realm. Excellent. I oh, know that's not. It's not. I oh, know it's not. His realm. Thank you. Right. Okay. How are we looking? Can I do anything else for gold? I do love gold. We don't need to work off stress. Thank you. Get out. I mean, that's not bad. I mean, it hasn't been, to be honest, as, as kind of explosive as yesterday. Um, kind of because we've been forced into it. 75, though. Man, I think we could have risked carrying on with Song Hey. I didn't really think we might have. What about Canon then? We just, we just clapped them once. I can do it again, damn it. Right, declare war. Um, Fade Kingdom. 2,000 prestige. I think we could do it. I genuinely think we can do that. 2,000 prestige with, with, with this character as well. I think that's doable. Just have a feast or two. Do it. 
This is going to be incredible. And then we'll take the whole bloody thing. 150. There you go. Told you 2,000 prestige. Should we go for it now or should we save it for tomorrow? Because that seems like it could be quite a giant war. I think we probably overran anyway. So tomorrow, we're just going to go mad invader. We're going to take the entirety of Central Africa here. I want to take the holy site. I want to reform the religion basically as early as possible. Last thing we want to do is... Convert the religion right at the end where we're an emperor and just sit there converting title after title after title. I know the achievement is broken through it, right? But I want to do it the right way just to say that we've done it. Um, just, to, to, just to kind of prove a point more than anything else. Uh, and I can, I can tick it off in my heart. Maybe not on Steam, but in my heart. And that's all that really matters. Thank you all for watching. You guys matter too. Uh, but the people who matter the most are the executive producers for keeping the channel going in the first place. A big thank you to The Monk, JT, 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 Slippinips, Holy Reapers, Ellaby, The Durst of Time, Small Snake, Daedric Daikatana, Potarted, I Am Sagatair, Ben Henshaw, Soul and Breen, King Snitch Gaming, Celentelli, and Paul, Demon Boy, and Chris for their support at the Executive Producer Tears on Coffee. Thank you to you all for keeping the channel going in the first place. And a thank you as well to Eckle Cakes, Hero Club, Chatulski, Archbishop, Blood Riot, Kamikaze, James B, Smirtworm, Galupo Fruit Hag, Don, Afanifist, Dinosius the Esoteric, Blubbubba, Plumby, Fred, and everyone else at home for supporting and watching the channel. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> you shit.